An unproven U.S. civil suit accuses Saudi Arabia's de facto leader Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman of sending a hit squad to Canada to kill former top Saudi intelligence official Saad al Jabri. The lawsuit filed with the U.S. District Court in Washington, D.C. alleges that on or around October 15, 2018, less than two weeks after the extrajudicial killing of Jamal Khashoggi, another team of Saudi nationals traveled across the Atlantic Ocean from Saudi Arabia to Canada where Dr. Saad lives in exile with the intention of killing al Jabri. Dr. Saad al Jabri is a veteran of the government of Saudi Arabia who fled three years ago and had sought exile in Toronto. The group of hitmen known as the Tiger Squad sent by Mohammed bin Salman, also known as MBS, failed to kill al Jabri as they were allegedly turned back at border. Even though the scheme was thwarted when the group failed to get past suspicious border officers at Pearson International Airport, Saad al Jabri's life remains in dire peril, the lawsuit says. Al Jabri believes two of his children, who were detained in Saudi Arabia earlier this year and whose whereabouts are not known, are now being used as human bait to lure him out of hiding. In the lawsuit, Al Jabri is seeking unspecified damages from bin Salman and his associates for orchestrating an attempted extrajudicial killing and for violating international law. None of the allegations have been proven in court. The lawsuit alleges Al Jabri was targeted because of his close ties with the U.S. intelligence community, intimate knowledge of bin Salman's activities and potential to undermine ambitious influence and support from the Trump White House. Al Jabri was also an aide to Mohammed bin Naif, who was a rival to bin Salman in a bid for the throne. After receiving intelligence that his life might be in danger, Al Jabri fled the kingdom in May 2017, first to Turkey, then to Canada, according to lawsuit. In June 2017, bin Salman ousted bin Naif in a coup and became the de facto ruler. In the ensuing months, MBS allegedly tried to pressure Al Jabri into returning to Saudi Arabia in a series of WhatsApp messages threatening to use all available means to find him and telling him, we shall certainly reach you. In 2017, Mohammed bin Salman carried out a bloodless palace coup with his father's blessing. He effectively was used up the next in line to the throne, Prince Mohammed bin Naif, becoming crown prince himself. That deposed prince is currently arrested. The assets have been seized and those who worked for him have been removed from their posts. Khashoggi was also a prominent journalist who had been critical of the Saudi government and Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman and was murdered when he visited the Saudi consulate in Istanbul on October 2, 2018. He never emerged from the meeting. His body was dismembered and his remains have never been found.